Good day everyone. Welcome to our prayer convergence. And as we start, let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you God for giving us a chance, Lord, to be in your presence, O God, to um, lay down our petitions before you, Father. Thank you, Lord, for giving us the chance, Lord, na makakadto si muna presensya, O God, knowing that uh, we are sinners, Lord, and we are, um, Father, um, doing shortcomings sa mga life, but still, Lord, you are able to forgive us, Lord, and grant us the spirit to repent, O God, kabay pa, Lord, that as we hold on to your presence, O God, you will hold on to us, Lord, that whatever happens, O God, we will not fall, we will not be shaken, because you are with us, O God. In Jesus' name we pray, in the power of your Holy Spirit, Amen. So let's praise and worship God in spirit and in faith.
Chronicles chapter 16, verse 11. Look to the Lord and His strength. Seek His face always. So, mga muyo kita. God, thank you again sa amon nga pulong. O God, ikaw Lord, mag-bless Lord sa imon na word. Ikaw Lord, mag-guide Lord sa ako. And Father, as I preach your message, Lord, kabay pa Lord, that you will um, guide Lord sa wisdom sa amon to understand your word. And hope Lord, that we will not um, receive this in vain. But grant Lord, nga ang mga pulong Lord will be our strength, kid Lord, our shelter, our refuge, O God, kabay pa nga. Through this word, Lord, of yours, we will be able to um, correct ourselves, Lord, to be guided, Lord, as we live each day of our life. Jesus, so, I pray with the power of our Holy Spirit. Amen. So, sa First Chronicles chapter 16, verse 11, nigang balda na, Look to the Lord and His strength, seek His face always. So, during prayer times, or quiet times to God, our purpose, most especially good, is look to the Lord. Magtulok sa gino. So, may mga times pag ganito, the ba practical advices bala, nga, why do people close their eyes when they pray, because um, ano na kanoon lang mas makapokus, like, hey God iba naman niya, galakat, iba naman niya gitangla sa langit, or gihigda giluhod, so whatever it is no, for them, nga makapokus, kay Lord amon na siya ang ginaubra natin because our purpose when we are praying is to look to the Lord nang magtulok sa gino so, our life is very distracting damo-damo, subong um, sa isa lang kaoras, sa damo-damo ka na pwede maubra. Um, pero ang kasubo, no, um, ang mga ginapang ubra ta, during those times are sometimes trivial. Mga bata trivial, na mga wala man pulos na butang. And, ng pleasures of this world, the last of the flesh, last of the eyes, and the pride of life. Those things are distracting us to look to the Lord. May mga times, no nga, um, we feel nga mas worth it na mas pleasurable na siya, mas desirable na siya. But we fail to recognize nga after all, after at, at the end of the day, no, those things are meant for our destruction. Because wala agad na ginahatag ang sin nga pleasure or may harap ginahatag nga pleasure pero hindi lang lasting. Mas dako pa or way worse pa ang mahatag nga nga destruction kisa sa mahatag nga pleasure sa ito for just a short span of time. Um, as Travis Zacharias said below, Sin will take you further than you want to take. It will make you stay longer than you want than you want to stay, and it will cost you more than what you're willing to give. So, sin um is not something that we can control. It's not something that we can um slave, but it is the other way around. Kita ang gina control sang sin, kita ang gina slave sang sin. So the 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 only way for us to let go of sin is for us to abandon it, for us to um, surrender it to God, not to dwell on it, not to um, think about it, not to um, take part in it every now and then. So, it's a difficult battle, but I believe no nga si Lord, nang He is willing yet to help us, and nothing is impossible with God. So, look to the Lord and His strength, and as we look to God, as we focus our eyes, our heart, our mind to the Lord, we are um, reminded to to look as well sa iyang strength ng alam always kung mabati ay na that people um, na, na we are tired we are not enough sometimes bala sa strength natin na damo tagi na fulfill ng obligations ng responsibilities damo mga tasks nga nambudli yan tanga brahon ni kita lang and what's amazing to God is humble sa ano no nang Sa verse man, no, pinalipat ko sa reference, it says there, nga, the strength of the, the, the strength of, of people is just weakness to God. And the wisdom of the people is foolishness to them. Kung ano man, kung ang pinakataas, or yung pinakaalam, sino niya kalibutan, ang kaalam na is foolishness to God. At sino mo din pinakastrong sa kalibutan, no? ang iyan na strength, yung maximum, is just weakness to God. Amo naka-powerful si Lord. So, nang, kung kita, no, gakaluya ta, let's not find a strength sa lust, let's not find strength sa people, sa mga wrong persons, let's not find strength sa vices, let's not find strength sa sin, but let us find strength in the Lord. And we can find strength in God if we allow ourselves go na magbuka sa pagipuso unta to let this word nga mag-enter sa and to give us hope to believe 
because without believing, no, we are already condemned. So, kabay pa nga, we will choose not to go sa left or sa right or sa mga ginahatag sa kalimutan sa ito, but we will always go straight to the heart of God and to um, accept the strength that He wants to give us. Amon, amon na siya ang gusto gid ni Lord para sa ito. And sometimes, when we think na Lord, um, hindi ko gusto ang palapit si mo because weak ko, because madimad naman ko Lord's strength si mo, pero may lakagapa ngayon si mo. Pero um, that's the, the nature of the Lord. No? He is a giver, He is a provider. And if we will not come to God, no, dama kita substitute sa strength na dapat makuha ta ki Lord. So let's not listen gid sa ginambas ng enemy nga. Hindi ko naman kito because basi mang basi ng kandan ka ni God for, for being weak. Pero the moment we are weak, the moment we are struggling, that, that is the moment pag niya magsigisigi tabalaw ng mga yung strength kay God. And lastly, seek His face always. So, um, seeking His face, balaw, have many na implications or many things nga nabasa ang kuman about, about the face of the Lord. So, um, it's a debate, you know, because no one sees God pa, no? And no one sees God nga nabuhi, except siyempre kay Moses, except sa mga chosen people, again, tagaan ni Lord sa privilege. Pero, now, what does it mean, balaw, to seek His face? Nga, Ang muna, nang, nang, nang pangita ko ang face ni Lord, datawan ko kung anong sure ang mata niya, anong sure ang ilong niya, ang bibig niya. Hindi na siya muna. When we see that we are to seek His face, in Genesis 33 verse 10, Jacob said, No, please, if I have found favor in your sight, um, then accept my present from my hand, for I have seen your face, which is like seeing the face of God, and you have accepted me. So, remember the story of Jacob and Esau. When Jacob um, deceived Esau, no? And sometimes, nung naging strong na si Jacob, nagpuli siya, no, from so hindiin mo siya na ilagyo. And si Esau naman, nang, nang he is there, no, to accept Jacob. At that time, no, Jacob was very frightened, gitrembol siya, katama sa presence ni Esau, because kabalo siya, nakasala siya kay Esau. And he is not um, secured if Esau, if Esau is willing to forgive him. So, Jacob, nung naging siya plan, siya tin Gino, nga unahon ta ang mga team A, team B, para akong lagso ng team A na makamarkit ng team B. Amun na siya ka big deal na ang sala and nobre ni Jacob because that, that was birthright ni Esau. That was his um, kumbaga bala ng pamana, inheritance yan no, ang yung uh, spiritual blessings ginkuha ni Jacob just in exchange for a bowl of soup. So, and that time, sang nakita niya si Esau, no, na Esau did nothing para makapapafeel siya, ginakondem siya. With all sincerity, ginhag siya, ginig patawad siya. So, naghabalda si Jacob nga nakita niya ang face ni Lord sa face ni Isa. So, it only implies nga when we see the face of God below, we see acceptance. We see acceptance and we can only be accepted by God if we are forgiven of our sins. So, it's kumbaga ng go together na sila. Ang acceptance and ang forgiveness ni Lord. We cannot be accepted by God unless our sins are forgiven because what separates us from the Lord is our sin. So, nang, that's the beauty but love seeing the face of God is a seeing forgiveness, seeing um, reconciliation, seeing restoration. So, when we seek God, no, we, 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 not, we do not seek balhaw ang physical features ng face, but we seek His forgiveness. So, um, kabay po that we will always remind ourselves about that, nga, when we seek God, no, we seek His forgiveness. And second is Exodus 33 verse 11. Um, then the Lord used to speak to Moses face to face, just as a man speaks to his friend. When Moses returned to the camp, his servant Joshua, the son of Nun, a young man, would not depart from the tent. So, um, this was um, a scenario before, nga si Moses nang getalk sila ni Doan ni Lord, and kung magtalk sila bila face to face, and si Joshua, uh, Joshua, um, uh, Joshua, son of Nun, alright, hasagwa, di siya pwede no ka kapalapit siya pwede ba kay God because kung makita ang ganyan ng face ni Lord, papatay ka. And the moment na magawa si Moses sa sta, yata, gasiya iya nga siya, gasiya iya nga face. And naman na siyang glory ni Lord, kumbaga. So, um, the second thing that I would like to point out about seeing the face of God is like seeing a friend. Talking to a friend. No, and most of us no would consider God as, um, a distant Lord, pero hambal ni God, no, I am not distant. Whenever you pray to me, I am near to you. So, lapit si Lord when you pray to Him, even if you don't feel it, even if you don't um, acknowledge it at times. Pero kada mag-pray, tanong si God, lapit-lapit, kadya sa ito. 
he is not like other gods. And naman na nang, when we seek his face, we are seeking a friend. Sa, sa gino, sige. And what's, what is the opposite of it? In Psalm 7 verse 10, Do not hide your face from me, and not turn your servant away in anger. You have been my help. So, um, la, siya natapos sila. Pero ang 7 verse 10, it talks about, for, if forsake ni Lord, you abandon kay ni God, you reject ni Lord. So, um, when we stop seeking the face of God, we are stop balahaw ng seeking His acceptance, pleasing Him ng doing things na maka, makapalipay kay Lord, and hindi makapake kay God. So, when we seek God's face, we are seeking His acceptance, doing things that will um, please, that will um, make our King smile. So, by ba that we will not um, stop seeking His face, seeking His acceptance, and doing things right that will make Him happy. So, um, sa Marino, it's for sure, Nico 16, 11, Look to the Lord and His strength, seek His face always. So, kabay pa, itagid malipat, nga morning aton nga, ubuhon each day of our life. So, let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you, good God, sa sininga word mo, Lord. Ikaw maga, guide sa mo to, um, um, to apply these things, oh God. Lord, help us not to live our life ignorantly of our word. Speak to us directly, oh God, and let your a message, Lord, be clear to every one of us that we will be able to use this, Lord, use this as a weapon, man, Lord, to combat the schemes of the enemy over our lives. We thank you for all that you've done. In Jesus' name, we pray with the power of your Holy Spirit. Amen. So,
I'm not spray. I've been fired with colored mga blush. Kung mga tao, Lord, yun naman yung subong na day. Even, Lord, sa mga gusto mati, but wala, Lord, ng tiyempo o God or ang um, time, Lord, kabay pang i-bless magit sila, Father. And, Lord, allow your spirit, Lord, to be upon us, O God. Allow your um, heart, Lord, to be revealed upon us, O God. Lord, ikaw mag-shelter someone from the lies of the enemy, Lord God. Anoint our, our minds, Lord, with your oil that no, um, no deception of the enemy will be able to penetrate our thoughts, O God. At kabay pa, Lord, that as we live our life, teach us, Lord, to hold on to you, to look into your strength, O God, to seek your face, and to know that you are, you are all we need, O God. In Jesus' name, we pray with the power of your Holy Spirit. Amen. God bless us all and hope to see you next Thursday.